Hey, 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 what's going on, YouTube? Takatanaka Giants here with a uh, three package mail day for you guys. Three packages in from three different YouTubers. Uh, before I get into that, I have two boxes over here, two no unopened boxes. Uh, it was actually my birthday a couple days ago, so I went out and picked up a, a box of UFC Finest. Uh, one master box has six autographs or relic cards. Uh, so that's, that's going to be pretty nice. Looking forward to that break. And I also picked up a box of 2012 BBM Genesis. This is actually a brand new product here in Japan. Um, it's a high-end product. It costs about $150 for one of these mini boxes here. Or sorry, one of these boxes. And within one box, there are four mini boxes. So it's kind of like a mix between um, museum collection and maybe finest. Um, kind of two together. You have the mini boxes, but then within each mini box, you have five packs I believe something like that so it's 20 packs total per box and um, each mini box is let's see you're supposed to at least you're supposed to get at least one uh, serial numbered card and then there's some there's some like ridiculous stuff in here um, ridiculous autographs ridiculous memorabilia cards so I'm kind of looking forward to that um, one of the cards is actually um, I mean this is a mark to share obviously but uh, just for an example, um, they use a lot of ball relics here in Japan. So you would have like this is the this would be the border of the card, and then in the middle here it would just be a cutout of a baseball that's thrown in game used baseball uh, with the team logo that runs across it. Uh, baseballs here in Japan for the home team they actually have the logo of the team on the baseball, so you'd actually have the logo running across from a game used ball. That's pretty cool. Um, they also have some of the uh, star players actually sign the baseballs, and then they cut up the baseballs and they uh, flatten it out and they put that in the card so uh, pretty sick stuff in my opinion um, some stuff that you don't really see in the states or in MLB products or Topps products rather so um, yeah looking forward to that break maybe this weekend but uh, here we go guys so uh, on to the three packages package number one is actually going to be from S. Feistel um, I was in one of his uh, group, breaks, uh, group breaks rather for uh, Topps Chrome a while ago and um, these are the cards that I picked up I believe I had three teams I think I had the Tigers which I was part of a Tigers case break and um, well I, I was in a case break with BDK and 721 I'm pulling the Tigers so got some more Tigers cards um, but uh, here are the cards that I got these are just the base and I think there's one refractor at the back but yeah nothing uh, too fantastic here like I said um, yeah so I had what Detroit Cardinals and the Padres I actually traded for the Padres um, and that's a refractor in the back, uh, Jason Mott, I believe. But then uh, I did get a hit from a uh, from an unclaimed team, Adrian Cardenas, Ricky Carr. This is the black refractor, actually number 200. It's pretty nice. I didn't have any of his stuff, so um, that's going into the Topps Chrome PC. And then uh, I think I think he threw these in as extras. I really appreciate it. Uh, I got this nice Bowman Platinum of Yu Darvish, Ricky Carr. Very nice. A uh, nice Topps Chrome refractor and the base. And I guess finally the biggest hit that I got. Um, well, aside from the Adrian Cardan Cardenas, but from my three selected teams was this Cameron Mabin um, X-Fractor. So, pretty cool. But uh, those are that. So, uh, thanks a lot, Steven. Thanks a lot, Spistel, for uh, sending these out to me. Um, his links will be down below if you guys want to get on more other future breaks. Um, I know he's looking to fill a five-star break, which is going to be pretty sick. But, uh, okay, guys, so on to the next package now. Um, this one is actually coming in from uh, 18 Tony T. And um, uh, says sorry for the delay. I had a... I had to get a mailer. Thanks for the trade. Um, we did a trade, kind of cash trail, cash, uh, cash trade thing, I guess, agreement. And um, these are the cards that he sent me. Now, this is kind of how it was packaged. Um, you guys let me know what you guys think. But this is the Chipper Jones Top's Finest. So I wanted a, a die cut. I'm going to probably end up chasing the whole die cut sets that are out for this year. So Top's Finest, Top's Chrome, Bowman Platinum, I believe. But um, And then the other one here is this nice Steven Strasburg as well so that's pretty cool uh, this is the finest moments this is phrase, faces of the franchise but the, really the one card that i wanted was this uh jorge posada for my 2011 allen and ginter um pc uh relic pc rather and um i noticed that when i when i pulled this out it wasn't in like in a penny sleeve or anything it was just sandwiched between the two top loaders and uh i don't know if it's going to come up really well on camera but like this thing's just beat to hell it's scratched up pretty badly and um it looks like somebody kind of chewed on the bottom left corner. Let me get a little bit closer. Yeah, well, you can really see the scratches in there now. You know, because this, this isn't cardboard, obviously. This is uh, plastic. So, um, yeah, it's, it's pretty beat up. There's some like, really wicked scratches go up along the top over here. So it's kind of, I don't know, kind of a bit of a waste of a card, in my opinion. So I have to figure something out with that. But uh, I love these two die cuts. So the two die cuts are pretty nice. And then the uh, the last, oh, so 1822, his link's going to be down below. I'll have to hit him up later. But um, the last package actually came in from uh, Mr. Fisherbike. This is my first trade with him. Very cool guy, uh, very friendly, very easy to deal with. And um, 
Yeah, very good trader. So let's go ahead and take a look at what he sent me. I guess he sent me like this nice, uh, this nice snap case with uh, some extras. So I really appreciate that, bud. You don't have to do that, but very nice. Uh, the cars, so the cars don't move around. But um, the note here says, uh, Andrew, I hope you like the extras I put in. I uh, put in here. I don't have much for your PC. Uh, thanks for the trade. Well, that's totally fine. Um, I don't really need extras that much, guys. I mean, not that much, but I don't really need extras at all. Uh, I know it costs a little bit to ship stuff out to me, but uh, here's what he sent me. World Future Stars uh, from Upper Deck. These are the WBC cards. Those are pretty cool. Um, this guy's from uh, Taipei, I believe, uh, Korea, and you have all the Japanese players. It's pretty cool. I love WBC. Um, I actually attended one of the WBC games, Japan versus the U.S., uh, quite a few years ago, and that was, uh, that was a lot of fun. Uh, China here. And uh, China here as well. And uh, I got a nice uh, Ubaldo Jimenez rookie card from Tops, a Chin Ming Wang from uh, Bowman Chrome, and a nice Kazuo Matsui numbered card out of 599. Nice uniform. So, uh, very cool card. So, thanks a lot for that, brother. Thanks for the extras. I appreciate it. Oh, and then there's also a, uh, sorry, this got stuck to the bottom of the, uh, the note, but it's a nice uh, K Igawa rookie card from UD Masterpieces. Very nice uh, card design. I love these cards. But uh, on to the cards. Um, well, there's another extra that I'll save for last. But the card that we traded for um, is actually from my museum collection uh, PC. It was nice. Uh, Neftali Feliz. Out of 179, dual swatches and an autograph. So it's a very cool card. like that one a lot. And then I guess an extra that he threw in. Um, I don't really remember trading for a, a tribute hit. But um, he might have thrown this in. Not quite sure. But um, I'm going to slow roll it. It's actually a really nice Burt Blylevin. Uh, World Series Relic, a World Series Design Relic, and this is numbered out of 99. So I actually have one of these already from the 99 set. Um, I also have one from the 25 and the 50 as well. I, I can't remember, but um, very cool card, very nice card. So thanks a lot for the trade, man. I really appreciate it. Thank you for uh, packaging everything very well. And um, yeah, so that's it for now, guys. So his link's going to be down below, and uh, I mean, as well as 1820 tweet and... 18 Tony T and S Feistel's link. So be sure to check them out and uh, look out for future videos when I bust these two boxes. And uh, yeah, so that's it for now, guys. Happy collecting. Bye bye.